Right, let's do it. Let's jailbreak your Fire Stick. Jailbreak, that term we all like to use. Let's open up your Fire Stick, ready for fully side loading with every app you need instantly. We're going to do it really quick. There's many videos out there on YouTube which drag you through going to websites, doing this, doing that. Hell, heck, I've made one. <laughs> I've made many of them, but we're going to do a real quick video for you with three steps. So watch through to the end and you'll get it all. First step is to follow the channel. Whichever platform you're watching this on, hit that subscribe button, hit that follow button, hit that like button. Make sure you're following the channel for later updates in the future. And now we're going to do it. So on your Fire Stick, Fire TV device, first thing you're going to do is go to that magnifying glass and you're going to type in here, Downloader. We need this to install onto our devices. So once you're on here, click on Downloader, get it installed, but do not open it yet, okay? Do not open Downloader yet. Once you see it there, you get it installed, but don't open it. Back to your home screen, go all the way to your settings cog, you then must go down to My Fire TV, click on Developer Options, okay? Developer Options. If you do not have developer options here, you quickly click on About, click on the name of your device where mine is Fire TV Stick 4K Max. Yours will be different if you're on a different device. Click on that seven times. Then when you go back, your developer options will be there. Okay, so you turn on ADB Debugging and Install Unknown Apps. You turn it on for that downloader app we just installed. That is one of the key steps. That is the second step we are currently doing. So you get that downloader installed, you do those settings. If you didn't understand that part, watch it again. Okay, so you need to find that downloader app. You will find it in your apps, or you can just search it again. Again, downloader. Click it. This time, we can open it up. When it opens, when it opens, it is 100% important if it asks for you to accept permissions, you accept those permissions okay you accept those permissions okay next up we're going to type in this url search term what we're going to type in here today is four eight seven four zero okay four eight seven four zero that is underneath in the description as well if you don't understand what i'm saying four eight seven four zero you then click on go and now we wait this will install a full app full of all the apps you need for your device. We're not going to a website, anything like that. Let me get out the way. Okay, once this pops up, we click on install and we click on done. You can now delete this file and delete this file. Brilliant. Done. We've got it done. What we need to do is find what we've installed. You go to those three squares and a plus on your Fire Stick Fire TV from your home screen. Scroll down and at the bottom you will find one which looks like a clock with a flame on it. Open that up. And this now has everything you need on it. Okay, obviously around the world you can open up different apps, you can install different apps. Every country has different licensing on what you're allowed to install in your country. You're going to need to figure that one out for you. I'm not going to tell you what you can install, but in here you've got new updates. You've got top APKs, Android TV stuff. You've got APK seekers. You've got essentials, VPNs, gaming, KODI forks, live, mobile, music players and browsers, sports, tools, and adults only. Some of these need a pin number, like the one we're highlighting now. If you need that pin number, comment underneath, and myself and other people will help you out with that. You've got updated APKs at the top, which is the latest updates of all your apps you're after. Check them out as well. Any pin numbers, ask in the comments. That was part two. The third part you need to do is obviously tell me in the comments how that went for you. OK, we did it quick. We're in about four minutes 30 and you fully got your device ready to go. OK, all the apps you needed, everything like that. But make sure you do check the copyright and licensing in your country because some apps you can have in say America you can't have in the UK some you can have in the UK you can't have in America so do check what you're allowed check out those apps and that's down to you I can't show you any more than that brilliant I've been Doc Squiffy if you want a VPN as well we've got some great deals linked underneath thank you all for watching hit that subscribe button and I'll see you soon